Hi, my name's Sean. Uh, I'd like to welcome you to Colton RV Widget Wednesday. Today we'll be going over the Dish Playmaker satellite dish. It's a portable satellite. Um, the great thing about this is if you don't want a roof mounted satellite dish, uh, this is really easy to use. There's no power cord, all there is is a coax cable. Um, first thing you're going to do with the satellite dish is you're going to find a location outside next to your trailer, somewhere that's clear in the sky to where you can see that there's going to be no blockage from the trees. You're going to take your coax and hook it to the satellite. This particular one is a dual playmaker. You can hook up two coax connections. So you can hook up two satellite receivers. Right now we're only going to run one, but you can do two. The only difference when you do two satellites, you have to watch the same station. Not the same station, but the same satellite. So you can watch two different stations as long as it's on the same satellite. If you want to watch different stations on different satellites, you would have to upgrade to a roof-mounted dish. Um, so once you're connected here, you're going to run your coax cable here and connect to the travel trailer. We're going to go on inside and show you where we connected. Now this particular travel trailer has a connection right outside for the satellite dish. Some trailers you have to go through the cable hookup. Uh, your motorized are the same thing. A lot of your motorized will have it in the wet bay and it'll say tripod. And that's where you would hook up to the tripod satellite hookup. Once you're hooked up here, we can go inside and hook everything else up. Once you're inside, you're going to want to find your port for the satellite light hookup inside. So this particular unit, it's up behind the TV. We're going to hook our coax up to the wall plate and run it down to the back of the Wally satellite receiver. Once you're here at the Wally satellite receiver, you're then going to hook your HDMI cable up directly to the TV. Uh, they do provide an RCA hookup if you want to do that too. Then once you're here, we're going to turn it on. And then it'll go through and find its signal. Just got to get that. I'm just going to reset the system. All right. And then right now what it's doing is it's going through and trying to find the satellites. Once it finds the satellite, the first initial hookup of the Wally it's going to go through a test procedure. It's got to test to make sure you got the satellite. Then it needs to go to activation. And then you have to call in and pick what package you want. The biggest thing with the Wally, there's a whole bunch of different packages starting at $40 up to $200. Uh, the nice thing about DISH is they have a pay-as-you-go pay program. And what that does is you pay your bill, you have satellite. You don't pay the bill, they turn it off. And then when you pay again, they activate it. Uh, it's really good for the RV industry because most people don't camp all the time, so you're just going to pay when you use it. Uh, there is a single option mode too, so this is the Playmaker Dual. They do offer a single one if you just want a single port. Uh, these are able to be roof mounted. They make a kit to where you can move, mount it to your roof of your fifth wheel travel trailer or motorhome uh, if you don't want to have to constantly move it around out, outside and in. Uh, this setup comes with the Wally. So it's a Dish Playmaker satellite with a Wally. Those are $349.99 and that comes all together. Uh, you can purchase a second uh, Wally receiver for $99. Uh, but it's a bundle package. Um, they do offer multiple satellites. There are satellites available for direct TV. Uh, there's in motion satellites that you can mount to your roof. And then there's a big stationary satellite they call a Traveler. And what that does is that'll give you the option to run multiple uh, receivers. You can do up to four receivers with the hopper package with the little Joey's. 
Uh, but just for a quick portable, if you want to use it at home, use it at the campsite, use it while you're tailgating with your pickup truck, just take a TV, have an inverter to, to run the power for the Wally, and that's all you need for it to work. Uh, but the, ver the biggest thing with these is you can only watch uh, on the same satellite. So if, if someone's watching a movie on satellite 110 and someone wants to watch something on 119, you're not able to do that. So you, both stations would have to be a 110 satellite or a 119 satellite. Uh, so some shows are on different satellites. So, right, correct. And then if you get the HD package, that adds a third satellite to, to the satellite to find. So then you're up to three different satellites you could be looking on. And... And these will work on any any trailer, any motorhome. Even if you don't have a trailer, it'll work. You can use it at your house. You can use it, like I said, tailgating at a Bills game, a hockey game, wh wherever you want to use it. Uh, as long as you have clear visual to the sky, it'll work. Is there any questions, Bob? Or Why do you think we don't have connection now? We had connection a few minutes ago. It's the the receiver's rebooting okay. now, so it's just got to do a factory reset on it, which usually takes a couple minutes to do. So if you don't use the receiver after they've been plugged in for a while, it'll just go, and then you have to do a factory reset. Uh, the biggest thing is it'll let you boot the receivers and get to a certain point, and then at that point you have to stop and activate the receiver. Usually the first time you set up the receiver is going to take 15, 20 minutes to set it up. After that, you're going to find your satellite within a minute or two, and you're good to go once you've already had this activated. The first initial acti activation takes the longest because it's got to find the satellites, it's got to check its switch type, then you have to call in and activate it with this network. Uh, So the Wallys will just go through, and then it'll do step by step, just like if you had a satellite at home, DirecTV, Dish Network. It's going to be the exact same setup with your receiver, uh, and it does everything for you. You don't have to switch anything. All you do is hit next. Uh, but for the price of three forty nine ninety nine, it's a great deal on these, with, especially since it does come with the receiver. The receivers themselves, like I said before, is a, are a hundred dollars. So you're getting that with a satellite and a receiver for $349. We have a lot of customers that have started mounting them to roofs of motorhomes. These are considered a stationary automatic satellite. So what that does when you put it out there, it's got to be stationary to find the satellite. There are in motion satellites that you can put on the top of your RV. So where you're traveling down the road, you'd have satellite signal while driving. Um, so this is what it's going to do is it does, it pairs the remote to the Wally, and then it's just going to walk you through all the setup process. process. Once it gets here, it's going to do your test installation, which it'll go through, find the satellites, check your switch, and then when that's done, you go to activate, and then it'll download everything you need to do. And then you just, when you're going through, the only thing you're going to do is you're going to put down what state you're in, the mode, can stay the same and then you just scan it and it'll go through and check everything uh, the first like I said this first process could take 15 20 minutes depends on how quick and how good of a signal you're picking up if you're in the hills in the mountains you're still gonna get satellite it just may take a little bit longer to download everything all right that's all I got today on uh, dish satellites uh, but if you have any questions feel free to give us a call here at Colton RV our phone number is 716-694-0188. You can ask for, my, ask for me. My name's Sean in Parks. Uh, otherwise, you could ask for Ruben or Jacob, Ethan or Justin, and any one of us can take care of you and get you all set up with the satellite dish. Thank you for joining us today. Hope everyone stays safe and stays healthy. Thank you.